using one envelope, flap side up for visibility, push the thickest part of the envelope in between the separation roller and the feed roller. If it will not go in far enough to hit the envelope stop pawls with resistance, adjust the separation gap with the adjustment knob. Turning the knob counterclockwise loosens the separation by widening the gap between the two rollers. The envelope should be able to slide in between the rollers with a bit of resistance without allowing a second envelope to feed. Once that is done, pull the envelope out and turn it so it is positioned correctly for feeding, which is flap side down and trailing. Insert it until it hits the stop pawls, then use the side guide adjustment thumb wheel to adjust the side guides so they are almost against the sides of the envelope. This prevents skewing of the envelope as the envelope is fed in. Loosen a stack of envelopes and place on top of the bottom envelope. Shift the envelope end support in or out so the flap side of the envelope is lifted approximately 20 millimeters and the spine of the envelope stack is aligned with the painted line on the envelope end support. Turn the support so the weight of the envelopes is evenly distributed on both sides. Loosened stacks of envelopes can be added to the existing stack while running as needed since the envelope hopper is a bottom feed system.